Okay, in this step, what we're going to do is we're going to refill door panels to make them where they don't uh, scratch tint. And this one's been done. It was removed out of a, uh, I'm going to go back a little bit, 2007 Honda Accord where we wrapped the the raw rubber where it touches the glass as it as it rolls up and down so that it doesn't scratch. This one hasn't been done. It's the real raw rubber. It's going to scratch most films. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this block acrylic felt. This is an inch and a half. I really need probably two inches. Uh, comes in a 50 foot roll. And we're going to use this alcohol microfiber and we're gonna we're gonna like prepare the surface that I'm gonna refill. It's later than I thought I had to look at my time piece. Okay. We're gonna put the felt on now. I'm gonna size it. Just by getting it and I'm gonna use my open knife to cut it. Probably a little longer than it should be, but I don't care. And I'm going to come over here and determine exactly where I want my felt to be, which I see exactly. I actually have to kind of push the... A little tricky sometimes. I just have to... Yeah, of course I'm having trouble for the camera, of course. Um, I'm going to stick it down in the crack here. I want to start. I've already prepped it with my alcohol, so it sticks pretty good. And once I know I got it sticking where I want it, I bring it around like this. Just really kind of pulling it tight. That's a good 3M backing on this product. We sell it. Flex film. And then we, we just roll it on around. That's pretty much it. Um, I'm gonna cut the ends off. You know, come over here for a second. Just kind of cut the ends to make them all neat. Do the other side. Don't really need much over here. And let me make this look a little better. All right. Now we got it in like we want it. It's ready to go in the car. Thank you. Okay, I've got all these felted. I uh, just want to let you guys know that sometimes when you get some of these uh, rubber rub rails, they get a little bit stubborn. We like to use a little contact cement that we bought at Walmart. Uh, you need to rough them up a little bit with some sandpaper sometimes to get them to stick really well. And uh, it makes a big difference. A little alcohol, rubber cement if you want to add to it. We put the rubber cement on the rubber and then we let it dry and then we stick the uh, adhesive um, on the rails and then we put the rails back in. I'll show you a clip of the, us putting the rails back in and then uh, how these things roll up and down and not scratch your tent. Okay, here we go. We've just reattached the door panel. That's going to be the part that the glass hits and this we're going to put it back on. Go ahead. And you would proceed with the steps you would normally proceed with to get the door panel back in and you will have a happy customer.